Bro, I'm sweating so hard, and I don't even know why. I don't always be sweating a lot. Looks like it, but now for some reason it's it, it, it's bad. Whatever. All right. <clears throat> Welcome everybody to the twelfth day of Yumas. We're still keeping that streak alive and going, and I'm proud of it. Today we are playing mm -hmm. some more Catherine Full Body. Now, originally. I scared myself. Originally, I was supposed to be playing Runner 2 and beating that, but my save file got corrupted. So, unfortunately, I'm going to have to go back to where I was last at. <laughs> That's going to take a while. But it's fine. I like the game anyway, so I don't mind. So, anyways. On the last time we played Captain Full Body... Um, we're diving into the story of Vincent. Tons of stuff have happened. Like, Vincent cheating. Catherine with a cake could, is possibly pregnant. Catherine with a C's all over us. And Catherine with a Q. We, we still don't know anything about her. Very mysterious. So, I don't know what's about to happen. Um, but hey that's the main point of the story let's continue we just beat what was it the prison chamber or something like that the mask of gold hides all deformities i love these quotes man i, I love games with quotes it's touching uh let me get up a little bit talk to these people first which do you think are more pitiful Men or women? This one? <laughs> a lot of people say that. When asked whether they'd like to return as a man or woman in the next life, the majority of people say they'd prefer to be a woman. Not me. Some scientists have even predicted that men will become extinct. It's the truth. Extinct? Apparently the Y chromosome is quite useless compared to the X chromosome. So it's possible. And what will happen to the human race if men go extinct? Maybe there will be a system where women can fertilize each other and bear children. Men try just as hard to live their lives too. Isn't nature harsh? But on the whole, I think women have it harder. Being manipulated by stupid guys, being ground down by life. I did. It's something I shouldn't have. And what are you talking about? It is the cross I must bear. Alright, man. You got a mail. Kind of scared me a little bit. Let's catch on the cue. Mm -hmm. I learned how to attach a photo. Erica let me try on her uniform before work. How do I look? I'll be waiting for you again. Have a great day. Ooh. Erica, oh my goodness. You look surprisingly good in that. Be careful, boss staring at you. And we're gonna work. Now, interestingly enough, hers you don't actually get by the text messages. Actually, I think her her requirements are a little bit different from what I remember. I don't remember a lot about this game. It's been a while since I played it. And he was extremely loose with his relationships with women. I heard his funeral got stopped because women were fighting each other. Oh. Well, you can't talk about it like you're unrelated to it. This lovely couple is Daniel and Anna. Huh? Vince? Vincent Brooks? What? Do I know you? It's me, Daniel. We went to elementary school together. Oh, uh... What? You don't remember me? Oh, so you're Vincent. You're different from what I imagined. Don't say that. You see, Vincent, I, I'm different from back then. I'm not the one tagging along. Now I'm the leader. I'm the heir to a successful business. A business heir, huh? Because of that. Wait, I heard your voice somewhere. Was it yesterday? Think of it. Maybe I had some premonition of our meeting today. Anyway, I can't believe you don't remember me, man. I'm sorry. How oh, do you remember? Uh, my phone. Pick that up! Pick it up. Hello? Shit her. What do you mean, oh shit? Oh yeah, were you at the cafe near your place around lunchtime? Uh... I 
can't tell you. Well, I, I can't really tell you that. Huh? What do you mean you can't tell me? Uh, well... Crap! Later? Wait! Is she okay? Crap, I chose the wrong choice. I thought I thought if I said I can't tell you that, I thought it was gonna be on more on the evil side. I was like not on the evil side. What so so if I would have said no, what would that have meant? Oh who knows? Oh I know it's man nah bro. I need some music. And you know what I'm about to play. Yeah. Good evening. Yeah. I should definitely stream Persona 5 Royal, but I don't know. There's been some uh, stuff going on with that. Would you like to speak to Lindsay? Would you like to speak to my The only reason I'm doing this is because this game isn't really that. Well, it is, but. When you have a lot of things to do, do you write them down on a piece of paper? When you have lots of things to do, do you just remember them? I remember that crap. This one? I don't think Mr. Morgan would say that. Twenty years ago, Mr. Morgan picked up a ball for me at the tennis court. Twenty years ago, Mr. Morgan walked in an ice cream shop to pay his tuition. Mr. Morgan likes vanilla ice cream. Mr. Morgan likes pouring maple syrup on vanilla ice cream. Oh. The cheese stretches. It is five days until the time of freedom. What are you talking about? Bro, how do they even know that? That's what I want to know. They hear like they like they really know everything. So. You know, Chief doesn't talk about his girlfriend, does he? He did say that he didn't plan to marry her, huh? He's so perfect at his job. I just kind of assumed that he was the same way in private. In school, never dated girls that he wasn't fully committed to. All the girls said he was just too defensive. Ask him about it, Toby. Ah, <laughs> oh, come on, that's not fair. I never really do explain that, actually. <laughs> this month, I'm running really late. I think I'm pregnant. Me raising a family? Doesn't exactly sound like a recipe for success. Catherine. <laughs> oh, is that name cursed? <laughs> Yeah, hey, you're in an interesting uh, <sighs> twist right now. I know this is subtle, but here's some trivia for you as you seem to finish the glass. There are two ways to classify drinks short and long. Short drinks have a high percentage of alcohol. They're served in small glasses so they can be consumed while the cocktail is still full. On the other hand, long drinks are cocktails made to be enjoyed for an extended period of time. They are served in a large glass. Whether you want to take your time and discuss the meaning of life over a drink, or gulp it down and get it over with, the choice is yours. That was the cocktail trivia for tonight. Empty already? Yo, Erica, I got an order. What do you want to drink? I'll try sake. Sake, please. I'll take a beer. Beer. Okay, I'll be right back. I see the same thing every time. Can y'all like switch it up? Sorry to keep you waiting. <laughs> you wanna know the latest info about the curse? No. Your news is grade A 100 percent bullshit. Oh, like you've been finding out anything useful. Tough. <laughs> that was way too close to lunch. If she's pregnant, that really means marriage, huh? Yeah, what are you gonna do, man? I know this is sudden, but here is some trivia about sake for you, as you seem to have finished your cup. Did you know that there are different words used to describe the varying temperatures of cold sake? Sake served at zero degrees Celsius is called Mizore Sake, and every five degree increase above that has its own name, such as Yukihie, Hanahie, and Suzuki. Such a poetic way to express their virtue. Use the names with flair 
and impress your friends. And that is the sake trivia for tonight. Say less. Do you already? You still want a drink? No, I'm cool. I guess it's checkmate for you, pal. People are free to have whatever kind of relationship they want, but uh, I've been with Catherine so long that it's probably time. Congrats on having a kid. Let's do something to celebrate. It's not for sure yet. She said no, she wouldn't tell you unless she was really sure. You're gonna do the right thing, right? Wait a minute. Hold on, John. <coughs> what are you upset over? Heck, I want to get married soon. You want to meet my parents and ask about how they got married? Go back home and drink some chocolate milk, kid. Come on, why you gotta go there? That was your favorite line, too. I didn't... <laughs> I'm sorry. Can I just... I feel so bad saying that. <laughs> I just... I said, hey. You know what you're gonna do, right? And I said, hold on a minute. <laughs> Yo! He sounded really confident in that crap. Like he's really about to cheat. Yo, no, keep no. I'm going for the evil one. I have to do this. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's crazy to think the love of your life can pass you by if you don't happen to meet at the right time and place. I mean, if you never went to that reunion, you and Catherine never would have gotten together. Life's all about timing, huh? Not planning out your life ahead of time's a waste of effort. None of us have the future we thought we would when we were kids. Oh, I need some sort of direction. Well, all we can do is move along. Oh, Vincent's stealing your line, Reverend John. <laughs> hey, I'm just a stray sheep in the field of life, too, you know. Oh, now that's Vincent. Cheating twice? <laughs> He's really gone uh, astray. I never thought you'd be one to cheat in the first place. I can't believe it myself either. That's crazy, yo. You got a mail. Yeah, see y'all later. Let me get the uh, captain with a cat. Yep. You still look straight sheep. Haven't you been there every night lately? I thought you had an upset stomach. Why are you drinking again? Please take care of yourself. You're not just living for you anymore. Sorry. Can I at least hang out with my friend? What's going on? Something wrong? Alright. I'm just being nice. I guess love knows no boundaries these days, huh? People these days, always getting swept up in the heat of the moment. Of course, my heart belongs to Erica and Erica alone. No one asked. So I guess they're taking applications from the general public for these space tours? Oh, 50,000. It's way too much. With my paycheck, I can't even afford a down payment. And boy, do I have a deal for you. I'd rather put all of my savings into lottery tickets than invest in one of your crazy schemes. Funny. Well, milk goes with everything. You know, I, I take it back, Toby, my boy. I'm a man, come on. What's that supposed to mean? You got a mail. Oh, did someone come in? Oh, Mr. Morgan. Alright, let me check the phone real quick. And I figured. <laughs> How are you doing? Are you still at work? Are you done yet? Yeah, I'm done. What do you want? Wait, no, 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 no. Let me try something else. Let me try something else. Sorry, I'm still at work. Let's have a drink sometime later. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> I know what I'm doing! I know what I'm doing! Yes, sir! Yes, sir! Why am I acting like this? Yo, this game! This is a late breaking update of the recent spate of mysterious weekend deaths. Another young male victim has been discovered. Ronald Clay, age 32, was found dead today. He's the same age as me. <sighs> That's all we currently have on this story. We'll be moving on to the news after a brief update on the weather in Area 15. The eldest son of the Barreal family led 1,500 relatives onto a fleet of private jets. Game. Okay. You seem tired. Please, relax in this salubrious bar. Well, how did it go with your girlfriend? I happen to overhear your conversation from here. 
What do you mean, how did it go? Nothing happened. Nothing yet, at least. Marriage, all in all, is a cowardly method that tries to subdue love through torture. <laughs> to steal a saying from a certain Turn someone. someone. Well, if you ask me, the trick to a long-lasting marriage is, frankly, to spend as little time together as possible. <laughs> Very interesting method you have there, sir. You call me now. And Catherine? Pick it up. Let's see what you gotta say. Hello? It's me. Oh, hi. Were you upset by what I said today? Uh Not in a bad way. I know. Well, I figures. Catherine? I'm sorry for calling you so suddenly. Good night. Excuse me. <laughs> huh? You gonna bother a cop on his break? This bar is really fancy now, having hired a piano player and all. If you want to ask me about that incident, I'm not going to be much help. But it's men around your age who are dying. So be really careful. You don't seem too interested. Yeah, no evidence has come up yet, and I'm on another case. Gotcha. I'm Morgan. If I find anything out about this incident, I'll tell you. So don't worry about the strange rumors. Well, I don't really care about the rumors. You got a mail. Uh... Someone else come in and boom. Let me check the phone. Oh yeah, Tom Archie. Sorry, maybe I was a little too harsh. I mean, I did overload you with stuff about maternity and even money, but it's important, so keep it in mind, okay? I'm sorry, too. You don't have to apologize. Definitely. I'm gonna be nice. I felt I felt very disrespectful after what I put after what I put in the text. I felt bad. You look tired. Don't get too drunk, okay? Yeah, I think you're a little too uh, late on that, buddy. I'm all, he's already drunk as it is. Do you know what you gotta have to be a real man? Lots of money, power. I hear him. Actually. See, only half a man's worth is in his upward mobility. He unleashes his full potential when he's surrounded by women. That's why a real man shares his love with as many as he can. Flowers of femininity blooming in the shiny rays of a man's love. I'm not after women. Then you're after me. Not a chance. Yeah, we know what you're after. You <laughs> don't gotta worry about that. You have indicated that today is a special day, so we're sending you a photo from the past to commemorate it. This photo is from the Florida Celebratory Intoxicated Anniversary. This takes me back. Dang, Catherine. Honestly, Vince has got to be one of the dumbest people to ever to actually lose someone like that. Man, my head hurts. That's because all you do is play Rapunzel. You should try it. I'm sure that princess is a hottie. She's a bunch of pixels. Seriously. What? Are you one of those guys who can only get turned on by real life women? Uh, it depends. Something so wrong. You got a mail. Alright. Secret about difficulty. The difficulty level yesterday stage is apparently just the beginning. If the later stages cause you trouble, you can always change the difficulty to safety by going to config on the bar. However, keep in mind that you can't redo any safety stages and awards and the scores will be recorded easily. Yeah, we'll need that bullcrap. We'll need it. Perhaps we all deserve pity, regardless of our genders. Dude, you gotta be- uh, I think I'll go home for today. My head hurts. Glad I talked to them. About, I, I'm gonna need you to be more confident in yourself, alright? You, you just bad talking to yourself. I don't think y'all have anything else to say about the other way. Do you think Ren will ever get her memory back? I don't know. It might need to be something to trigger. Yeah, maybe playing that piano will help. 
Anyway, let me know if anything happens. I got your back. Thank you, Bo. I'm surprised no one's come forward with any information about Red. Maybe no one's realized she's missing. Hmm. Wonder what her story is. Ah. Uh, it's this late already? If I don't go home, I'll make Catherine worry again. Yo, Vincent, we're leaving now. You're not going home yet? The night is young. I'm sticking around a little more. I need some time to think. Vincent, I'm going home now. Thanks for stopping by. Okay. <laughs> it's almost time. <laughs> Quit trying to delude yourself and come. Did, did I just hear something? That sounded so wrong. <laughs> You're here. I found you, Vincent. There she goes again. That sounded so wrong. Well, hello there. Don't call me that. It's embarrassing. What do you want to do today? Uh, actually, I... The perfect toy for a healthy baby. So much fun. Uh. Hey. Uh, hello? Hey, why are you just staring at the TV like that? Uh, oh, um... Hmm? When a baby won't stop crying, you have to gently... A baby? Oh, I get it, Vincent. You get it. Oh, Lord. Here we go. All right. There, there. It's okay. What's going on? Um, what was that? <laughs> this is what you wanted, right? You were staring hard at that baby on TV. Oh, no. I was... <laughs> now you're my little baby. Don't you worry about a thing. Uh... Something wrong? You're being awfully quiet. Is your tummy grumbling? You want mommy's milk, don't you? Huh? <laughs> what? Uh, uh. There's no need to worry. You'll get some real soon. Oh, come on, man. Did he really have to sit there and scream like that? What do you want to do today? I have something to do. What? You're so cold, jeez. Dude just got up and was like, ah! <laughs> Why did he do that? Oh, that was funny. Like, he's literally just wanting to tease him at this point. It's crazy. Uh -oh. That's all right. I look forward to seeing you. <laughs> You're going to be judged tonight at the Inquisition. Am I seeing things? You wish you were, but you're not. So stop. Alright. What's up with your boss? Hey boss. Ever lose your memory drinking? Uh oh. Did you? Yeah. I have when I was young. Especially when I was in my 30s. I started to blank out on amounts I used to be able to handle in my 20s. And then I'd wake up lying next to a complete stranger. Ah, so it has. I'm in a complete stranger's house? That hasn't happened to me. I'm at the police station, stark naked, right? No. The nakedness of woman is the work of God. To misappropriate the musings of a certain so, so, someone. In front of God's work of art, it's only natural that your faculties are preoccupied. Well, just don't worry about it. Uh, guess I won't. Boss, you be talking about some weird stuff. I'm thinking about it. Rin still has room to grow. Watching a young fledgling learn to fly. It's quite uplifting. I must say, having Rin work here has really helped motivate me to continue running this place. What has Erica been doing to you? <laughs> what have you been doing, Erica? Drinking here together. Hmm. Doesn't it bring back memories? It means we're old now. In high school, I wanted to grow up quick and be free. But now that we're adults, 
I realize that it's not that easy. No kidding. You guys haven't changed at all, though. You're always hanging out together. I had to laugh when I heard you started working at the same place Orlando does. Well, so what? He's the only place hiring. I'm jealous. For what? In the end, you're hanging out with us here, too. She don't want to work with boss, that's what it is. I ended up like this because I don't have anyone to love. Where are all the good men? How about boss here? No, uh, 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 no way. <laughs> he probably heard that. I made sure to say it so loud just so he'd hear it. I mean, Toby has feelings for you. Go talk to him. I don't know. I just don't feel like going home today. No, you're gonna take you're gonna take yourself out of here and go home. Hey, are you going home? I need to get home. I have something to do. Already? Well, bye-bye, Vincent. Yeah, let me get on up out of here and go to the Inquisition. Dude is up. Twelve at night. That's military time, by the way. This, I'm talking about, that, it would actually be 12 a.m. right now. I can't just stay the same. You're going to have to watch yourself from now on. You know what I mean, right? Oh, but I plan to go back to work after having the baby. We'll just have to split up the housework, okay? You can't throw your clothes everywhere anymore. Your late night drinking isn't cheap, you know. So I'll be handling all our bank accounts. So an interesting way to actually tell military time, just for something I don't know. The best way I can understand it is like, think of it like if it's 1300. <laughs> Tonight's stage is the Inquisition, where sinners are fated for punishment. Regrets mean nothing here. There is no saving a repeat offender like you. Jeez. Should you wish to escape judgment, you'll have to run. 1300 think of it like 13 minus 12 that's one o'clock 13 minus 12 is one o'clock you know 14 12 2 o'clock 15 12 3 o'clock then some like 20 and 12 8 o'clock 8 p.m then 23 and 12 11 you know think of it like that to subtract by 12 when you reach p.m use the properties of falling blocks to wisely climb the wall that stands before you that's been Mike psych tip facts Tip facts. That's when Mike's like facts 101. Look at this. Look at this, man. I'm being judged right now. What is this place? Y'all know what I gotta do first, right? YOLO! I had to do it. I had to do it. No ball. Oh, springs. Perfect. This is when we start introducing springs, eh? See you later. Okay, I can't actually go that way, so I'm just gonna go downwards. And we're gonna go to the uh, where am I going? Whoa, whoa, where are you going, bud? I don't know where I'm going. I don't even think I can. Yeah, let me just start over. I don't know what I don't know what was going on right there. Man, narrator, I literally just started the map, man. Let me get what I gotta get. All right, gee, get out of my way. Yeah, I'm ready now. I'm ready now. Bro, he took a deep voice. It's crazy. Okay, let me pull this out. That wasn't a good idea. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get the pillow. Get out of the way. 
But can y'all get out the way? Move! Bro, I'm about can't are you gonna go? Are you gonna go? Thank you. Move. Get out the way. Bro, I'm about tired of y'all. Thank you. Move. Get out of here. If you're stuck, maybe best to try. I wouldn't have been stuck if they would have just moved. Like I'm busy. And you're just standing there doing nothing. Go find something to do. Bro, I am messing up right now. Bro, what am I doing? Yo, I'm tripping right now. Okay, come on, come on, come on. I feel like I need to pull that out. Like, that way. Like, that way. That did absolutely nothing. Get out the way. Bro! Like, do y'all not have anything else better to do? Like, no? Then get out. Relax. Bro, I am getting tired. Of, like, why do y'all have so many spears? Nah, screw y'all. <laughs> You're gonna have to find another way up here now. They're gonna have to find another way up here now. I don't know how you're gonna do it, but you're lost. I ain't getting that. Now. All right, let's create a path. Ooh, that one block does not look good right now. Okay, maybe, maybe that maybe that did a little something. That. Crap, I'll tell you that. Uh, why am I gonna pull it up this way? That didn't do anything either, did it? Well, crap, now I'm gonna have to work with it, so. Wait, hold up. That did absolutely nothing. That was close. Hey, okay, hold up. Maybe I might have found a way. Maybe we can figure something out here. Move! Crap! This is hard. Like, this is actually difficult. And this is only normal difficulty. Imagine what hard difficulty would have been. Okay. We know how to get through here. Get out the way. You know what I'm doing. Get out the way. Get out. Move. Bro. Yeah, see you later. See you later, bud. Nope. See you later, bud. See you later, bud. Y'all ain't getting up here. Not today. No, sir. I know I can get that. Do I really care about it, though? I don't. I'm the one. I do care about getting that. That's going to be essential. How am I gonna do this? I want to try that method, but I can't because this is gonna ruin it. Maybe it doesn't necessarily have to be like that. Okay, block vex still applied. I didn't mean to push it that way. Okay, hold up, hold up. Keep it going? Okay, we kept it going. We kept it going. Okay, let's uh 
try something. Push it that way. Push it that way a little bit more. Push it over here. There we go. Now we made a path. All right. I'm pretty sure that was not the intended way I was supposed to do it, but I freaking did it. So I'm counting that as a win. Hey, I'll take a gold. Yes, sir. Playing that piano so good. I can't believe I'm starting to see these dreams. Is this some kind of karmic payback for being a police officer? I wish I could at least remember this stuff when I wake up. Wait, did you say you were a police officer? Hmm. Do I know you from somewhere? Thanks. It's kind of weird trying to recognize a sheep, isn't it? Seeing how you don't seem very winded, I can't be exhausted. I'll go talk to the others. Stop. Seeing how you don't seem very windy, I can't be exhausted. I'll go talk to the others. Vincent! Oh, I'm so glad you were able to make it up again. Come pretty far, huh? Thanks to you. What did I do? You told me that the only one who can decide how to live my life is me. I never thought of it that way before. I just assumed things were off limits before I even considered them. So now, I finally decided that I'm just gonna go for it. We got this. The other sheep and I, we'll make it through. <laughs> I really like that about you, Vincent. Um, can I be by your side cheering you on? Of course. That'd be a big help. I'm starting to regain my memory. This outfit I'm wearing, I think my brother gave it to me. I think it was on my birthday. I remember him smiling and... Saying it looked nice on me. Glad to hear things are starting to come back to you. Your brother must be worried. We've got to get you back to normal so you can go home. Yeah. I should get going, sir. Was that really Vincent? Me? Why would he appear just when I'm going through a tough time? He doesn't even remember me. What have I been doing all these years? Hey, hey. If you want an item, pony up some coins. Tonight's product is... The white cube creates blocks around you. Energy drinks allow you to jump two blocks into the air. No. Nah, I don't need to. Huh? You think you're window shopping or something, Fro-Man? Uh, uh... <clears throat> Excuse me. Please come again. Dude's really getting money even in a dream. <sighs> Men hate the women who love them and are attracted to women who don't. Oh, it's all my fault. I'm sorry. I'm apologizing. Okay. I'm sorry. I get it. I get it. I understand. Yeah. Yeah. Who do you think you are? Come out here and face me like a man. It's a man. Who are you? Who am I? You got to control. Oh, Master Cruz. What do you say? What's the thing that chases you? Hmm? Uh-oh. Well, sometimes it's my girlfriend. Sometimes it's... something else. I see. I envy you. You're being chased too. <laughs> Don't mind me. It's now. Well, time for my signals. That gentleman with the scarf knows the song quite well. If someone hates you, that means they're obsessed with you. What do you want? Nothing, man. Just wanted to wish you luck. What a kind fellow you are, Master Cruz. He, on the other hand, can be very strict. During our lessons, all it takes is one small mistake for him to explore. Huh, <laughs> kind. Huh, but you're here. You must be a scumbag, too. What did you do? What did you do for someone to want you dead? Uh, huh? Sorry. Never mind. I was working in the kitchen all night again, so I'm in a bad mood. Hey, Shiny. Sing it again. Take it from the top. Hmm. You listening? Oh, no. <laughs> it's you. 
Hey. I told her I'm real before. When I first ended up here, I got really depressed. She helped me out. There's a drawing I haven't finished. I can't die yet. That's what's up. I thought it was weird when that girl showed up, but I think I'm getting used to it. She always disappears once everyone makes it to the next land. I wish I could do that. Just warp on up there. One time, I tried grabbing onto her clothes before she disappeared so I could go with her. But it didn't work. I guess she's special. Hey. Hello. Hey, listen. I thought of a great way to climb. Allow me to explain the wall spider. Ooh, I like wall spider. Always be aware of your surroundings when faced with an unclimbable wall. You can easily hang from blocks to reach your destinations. It's a beginner level skill, but don't forget it when faced with a challenging situation. Think about it. Isn't it awesome? And would this work too? Allow me to explain the corner spider. Try moving blocks to form an L shape. <laughs> this one too. When you are hanging, you can move between blocks that do not share an edge. Hey, I didn't even think about that. I'll tell the others how to do that. Thanks. Hey, I wonder if I'm in this because I was associating with a younger crowd in our company. Do you have a wife? Yes, a wonderful woman who doesn't suspect anything about her cheating husband. Oh, I'm grateful. Cheating is the sign of a better man. All the women flock around the superior males. Sexual selection dictates that women prefer stronger mates to father their children. My father, he was a shitty good for nothing. He might have appeared good to everyone. Huh? Er, I'm sorry. Hot word. But he was a shit. Huh? Hello. If you make it to the top, you'll earn your freedom. Have you heard that? It's strange. I've heard a similar story before. The man who survives will have his wish granted. That's just a fairy tale, though. <laughs> it's just a rumor. Believing that stuff will only lead to more disappointment. All for stuff like that only makes you look stupid. <sighs> Yo, we were waiting for you. Huh? Me? You're an amazing climber. We were talking about techniques. Wanna join in? Sure. And I'll start off with the technique I came up with. Allow me to explain the cutout. Grab one block after another and move it towards your destination to provide a path. Easy skill. It's important to recognize which blocks you can let fall. Not bad, huh? Oh, wait a sec. Then would this be a technique too? Allow me to explain the cut across. Same with this one. Using the same principles of the cutout, throw out all the blocks you pulled out. By moving several blocks onto an unstable area, you can make your own stable footing. Dang, you pulled out a ton of blocks. Work though. <laughs> That's incredible. Not bad, buddy. You're very perceptive. Arr, easy. Damn it. Hey, you. Me? What? It is you. You taught me a lot before. It's me. Huh. I didn't see you yesterday, so I thought you were done for. I won't die. Not until I see her again. Wait. Is your family down here? Yeah, right. Don't you get it? It's only men that get thrown down here. What? Why are you worrying about other people? Save your own ass and get out of here. Dang it, you're okay though, man. <laughs> Why are you worrying about other people? Save me. Alright, Inquisition. So this one only has two, but the next one has three, I think. He talks down and really pisses me off. I'm just standing there. Look, look at the sheep. Look at the sheep. How much longer are we gonna play this game? Stop complaining and sit down. Why is it when I say hey to you, you just tell me to sit down? Like, come on, I just want to say hey. Hello again, my little lamb. And then you say hey Looks here. Looks like you and that pianist are getting on quite well. But I wonder, are you two really working toward the same goal? 
What do you mean? Appearing as a human without even climbing. Like some sort of overseer. What the hell are you talking about? What you choose to believe is up to you. Now let's hear it. This is the fifth question for a new possibility. Do you care what other people think of you? Do I care what other people think of you? No! Don't ever let other people think of you like that. You chose that one. I'm slowly starting to know you better. Now, this is the fourth floor. Once you're past this, you'll be halfway through. Finally, night after night. Now we should go easy on me, damn it. This is the punishment you had coming to you. I do feel a little bad, though. The one who dropped you into this place speaks to you on a daily basis as if they don't know anything while laughing behind your back. What are you trying to say? <laughs> we'll go soon. I'm assuming with the little crack in the thing <clears throat> means that I'm probably getting closer to Rin's room. If that's the case, I've gotten two so far. I've gotten two in a row so far, so. Wow. A lot of people seem to really care what other people think about them. Dang, man. Jeez. Come on, bro. See, women. See, women. See, this one is way skewed. See, more men care about what other people think for some reason. Women. Most women don't care. And then this one is just like. It's close. It's almost 50 50. Man, me personally, man, I, and I'm a man. I don't care what anybody thinks of me, bro. Like, I'm I'm living life. Main thing is, man, is to stay positive during this tough time, bro. If you're over here worrying about what other people think of you, I'm not gonna say you are sensitive, you're sensitive or anything like that. This is the final but area for tonight. You probably let a lot of stuff really get to you. And you shouldn't be doing that. Don't let don't like if like if somebody just says you're ugly, you're not ugly. Everybody's beautiful. Everybody is great. Don't 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 let that one person bring you down, bro. They're just hate. They're just a hater. A steep face is in your path. Stay calm and take it step by step. All right. Oh my lord! Oh. Yeah, that's the like you know. Serious? Stay away from me! I, did they detail? The child has it's the killer. I think they Enough. detailed it. She's already helping me. <laughs> Thanks. Alright, I got it. I think they detailed it a little bit more this time around. I don't know if that's just me, but I feel like they did. If they actually did, that's pretty awesome. Whoa! Don't want that. Don't want that to affect me. Oh, there you go, doing it again. Oh my no! That was close. Oh crap! Get up. Uh, do this. 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 We don't need that gold. Oh uh, crap! Oh crap! Uh. Undo. 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 Okay, okay, okay. Uh, how about this? Then this. Pull that back. Pull that. I literally just did the same thing. Undo. 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 What was the point of that? Um, just push that back. Push that out. Edge. Uh, push that one out. Edge. Okay, let's work with this. Uh, should I push that out? No, no, that's the only thing I could do. Alright, there we go. We got some room. Got some room. Where is he gonna... Okay. At the pace I'm going, I'm probably not gonna do it. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, but I'm still gonna try. Oh my god. I remember this boss used to scare me growing up. This boss used to scare me growing up, bro. 
It's just like it looks so scary to me. I know it was just a child, but it looks so scary. I'm like, no! Don't let it get me. Please, no, please, no! Oh! Uh, 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 you ain't getting me. Nope, not today. Not today. Let's go. Sorry! I gotta do, I gotta do what I gotta do. I gotta do what I gotta do. We're almost there, boys. Oh, man. Go to the other side. Go to the other side. Be calm. Be calm about it. Be calm about it. We, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Yes, sir! Woo! All right. me personally despite the fact I messed up numerous times I still think that's worthy of a gold I still think that's worthy of a gold come on give me that gold Ew. what 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 would I what did I need to do what did I need to do what did I need to do to get a gold right there I did that Dang, damn near as perfectly as I could possibly do it. How? So you made it this far. Fascinating. I want to know what kind of person you really are. Why don't we pull up some more old memories? You've been hiding from them like the day your love first bloomed. Oh, let's we'll see this. Gotta say, this is delicious. I'm so glad that we met up at that reunion. It's the least I could do. You're always listening to my problems. Well, I'd better get going. Am I really that undesirable to you? What? Catherine? There's something you want to tell me? You are beautiful. Day. How innocent you two were. Hmm. I wonder what changed. Or do you already know the answer to that? She hit you with that. Am I really that undesirable to you? Like, ooh. So, what did you want to talk about? <sighs> what are you doing here? <sighs> are you okay? Did you drink too much last night? You called me over, and you don't even remember. Huh? No way. I mean, yesterday, I... <sighs> What's wrong? You're acting weird. Weird? Me? God, why can't I remember the time I spend with you? It's like the important parts are missing. Oh, um, I remember them, though. Uh, well, I wonder why I... <laughs> Silly. Uh, the piano was so annoying. Huh? You think? My head hurts just listening to it. Did she hear that? Long hair. Ooh. Shit. That's Catherine's. Oh, I'm telling what she'll do. Oh, 
That's mine. Probably off my chest. <laughs> you know, manly. Huh? Your chest? <laughs> really? Yeah, yeah, you, you know, uh, it's, it's that... But you know when sometimes a long white hair grows on your body? It, it's good luck? But this is, like, really long. Yeah, I was growing it out. It just fell out by itself. <laughs> good thing, too. It's bad luck if you pull it out yourself, you know? Oh, really? It's not from another girl, is it, Vincent? No, why, why would you say that? You know, because if it is, I'm going to die right here. Hey, hey, hey. knock it off with all the dying stuff, okay? Then I'll kill you. <laughs> I die, or I kill you. Which would be better? <laughs> come on, come on, whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah! you don't answer me, I'll kill you. One, two, <sighs> three, four. Hey, come on, come on. Quit fooling around. <laughs> Bye. There's no other girl. Right here imagining things. Hmm. Is that the truth? Of course it is. Trust you. Thanks. How do you fall for that? <laughs> Was she serious? Yeah, I know she's trouble, but she is smoking hot. I'm not going to ask you about the past. I'll give you that one. She matter. is hot. But from now on, if you ever cheat on me, I'll be angry. Uh, <laughs> okay. <laughs> What's she even doing? Never, I never understood what she was doing. Like, is she biting his shoulder? I don't know. You don't have to get that, do you? Whoa, whoa, whoa wait, hold on. second <laughs> I should at least say hello. He gets real grumpy if you wake him up. He's sleeping in the back. Well, if you really think it would... <laughs> He's awake? Yeah, hurry up. Now hey! go, 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 go. <laughs> Sorry. Really sorry. I just wanted to protect you from the smell. Huh? He really smells. You know, when he was drinking last night. Oh, really? Yeah, I'm glad I got you out in time. Whew. Hey, we're not that close, but he kind of forced his way in while he was drunk. Oh, well, he is your boss, huh? Yeah, he is. You just seemed really stressed, so I came to see how you were doing. Well, thank you. Uh, come by after work and I'll complain some more. <laughs> oh, I got you something from the new shop that opened up. Oh, uh, yeah? Here. I'll see you later. Owen, I am pregnant. <laughs> I just wanted you to know. Oh my god. Shit. That was
was my last hope. You don't know how that makes me feel. Seriously. See ya. Why does he... Look, why does he have to come in mad like that, though? What was he upset about? That I locked it? Like, it's... Like, dude, it, it, like, if, girl, it's this apartment. Oh, uh, she moved in recently. She works at the bar with Erica. Plays the piano. Uh, isn't she cute? Well, bye. <sighs> You're in some trouble, man. We still need to meet my parents and tell them. Oh, and we have to pick a name, but that might be rushing things. I'll text you the details later. I gotta go. <sighs> Meeting the parents. I'm just gonna sit here and let this happen. Tempt me. Shit, if she finds out, I am screwed. I gotta do something quick. No time to think about the future. Still. You see the movie where the guy was, uh, you know. Shut up, asshole, and just give me some toilet paper, please. Well, quit mumbling. I can't concentrate in here. Still, this girl. Look, girl. Hey, what are you looking at in there? I want to see. can't go on any longer. I have to tell her to stop. Dude, do not delete that picture. <coughs> so, uh, you still doing the two-time in tango? Yeah, don't say it like that. It wasn't on purpose. Well, if she is pregnant, you gotta bite the bullet. <laughs> yeah, you're only saying that because it's not you. Hey, man, variety is the spice of life. You need to enjoy it more. Just like the wasabi-coated sushi they serve here. You know what I'm saying, bro? You suck at metaphors. What I'm saying is, you've got options ahead of you. Yeah? Maybe Catherine would be happier as a single mom than she would be with you. What, are you drunk? No, she wouldn't want that. Well, what exactly do you want here? <sighs> my mind and my heart don't exactly agree on that. Uh-huh. Well, you've got to be even more careful. You're caught. You can't call it an accident anymore. I know. I know. Accidents, huh? One more of them lately. The old guy next door to me kicked the bucket. I heard. Shocker, huh? But he always said like to party. Probably party too hard. He had this horrible look on his face. Really? It's like that stuff on the news. <sighs> anyway, have some magro. It's supposed to be good for your circulation. Huh? You're as pale as a ghost, man. Oh. You going to the bar tonight? Uh, maybe. You? Nah, I have to pass today. Got overtime. But I guess all you can do is drink and forget, huh? <laughs> Pretty much. Enough with the shitty piano! <sighs> Making my ears bleed. Oh, why don't you come play with me instead? Sorry, I'm in the middle of a performance. Huh? You gonna talk back to me too? All you bitches need to shut up and do what I say. Excuse me, but are you in charge of how other people live their lives? 
What's your problem? You fucking... Hey! Why don't you give it a rest? I don't know what you're going through, but don't take it out on her. Besides, trying to make other people change is pointless. I mean, I'm not one to talk. I'm telling you, if you want your life to improve, then it's up to you to... <laughs> Is he even listening? <sighs> anyway, you okay, Rin? Yeah, thank you. Don't waste your breath on guys like him. Man, you say some thought-provoking stuff. It's like you've got a whole nother perspective. Philosophically. Really? I think you're pretty amazing yourself. You always lift people up when they're down. <laughs> Do I? I mean, I've given people a lot of things to complain about. You know, hearing that from you makes me kind of feel like... <sighs> what the... Did we meet somewhere else? Ugh, damn it. Just confusing myself. Huh? Vincent, I'll be waiting for you. Don't forget, okay? Uh, yeah, sure. I'll be here again tomorrow. Dude, still sleep? You got a mail. Hello, I saw an article in the magazine about the best bakeries in the city. It's kind of embarrassing for a guy to eat on one alone. So I was thinking you might want to go with me. We can go to that place with a great view I was telling you about. If you want to go, please tell me what days you're available. So bye. Hey, sorry, man. Just that text I sent was just for Erica. Just pretend you never saw it, okay? I'm not going to be at the bar tonight. I have to go buy something. I think Johnny would be there, though. So be sure to talk to him. Also, don't tell Erica to bar anything. Okay. <laughs> Hi Vincent, we're seeing a special picture. Try to try not to act surprised if you're opening at work or something. Just thinking of your action, we can see this is me live. Shit! Can't look at this in public. Need to check this out somewhere where no one can see. But bro, it's not like anybody's here. Look at where you're at. Who's gonna see? Are you drinking? Good evening. Would you like to speak to Lindsay? Would you like to speak to Martha? I received a text from Lindsay. I received a text from Martha. Do you believe the rumor about the text that grants wishes? Um, no. This one? I don't think Mr. Todd would say that. I hear Mr. Todd's body is heavily scarred. I hear Mr. Todd was hit by an axe. He doesn't want to show those scars to his wife. I hear Mr. Archie has many new rooms. He gets new ones every time he sleeps with a woman. I don't think he can forgive himself. Oh. It's four days until the time of freedom. What are you talking about? Then this dude gonna sit here now like he don't know what to talk to him, Nah, he probably don't. Hmm? Eating sweets make me happy. Are you tired, Vincent? I hope I can play the piano I can make. If everyone is happy is when I'm eating sweet. Mm -hmm. Dang. I see you, girl. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. I think I can actually respond to that. Mm -hmm. Dang. That looks good. Ice cream tastes best. I I'll treat you to too much. Consider it a reward for all your hard work. Yeah. Okay, now that I'm thinking, I gotta get those choices right again. So I got two right so far. I'm gonna have to it's keep you. that up. How you doing? All I hear are rumors these days, even when I drink. I think these rumors gave me a terrible nightmare last night. These rumors are about cheating men, right? I gotta say, I, I'm a little scared. You have a reason to be scared then? I'm a piece of trash. 
cursing cheaters to death, I'd be the first to go. Trash? I killed my wife. What? That's the other case I told you I'm investigating from six years ago. You killed your wife, and you're still researching the case. I'm trash. Huh. That. Oh, sorry, I don't have any information about that incident. I'll be on the job today, though, so hopefully I'll have something for you. All right. Oh, let's go. Pick up. Hello. Hey, what's up? Well, um. Oh yeah. Have you eaten the cake I brought you? Oh, sorry, not yet. Uh, I see. Catherine. Why do you ask? I mean, you seem to have been thinking about something for the past few days. Well, I can tell. Oh, well. I'm sorry. I'll call you later. Bye. Yo! When we get married, but why am I? I didn't mean to get in front of him like that. The application fee. It's cheaper now. Yeah, it's cheaper. It's only fifty thousand dollars instead of eighty thousand dollars. What steal? Besides, that's just the application fee. Who knows how much more the triple cost? And what's this about marriage? You're joking, right? Uh, hmm. Trip into space. Huh? I never actually did get that. Idea, but I'm thinking about it. I particularly love this. This is my favorite uh, Catherine song on the soundtrack. I've got a confession to make. I'm really only an extra list. Oh, so you quit? I still do research, and I've stopped the whole writing part. Okay, but why? Long ago, I covered a story on a young girl, a ballerina, very talented. Lots of people were sure she'd make it big. I wrote an article about her because her story touched me. She was poor and had to take several part-time jobs while studying ballet. The article was a hit, and her popularity soared. It's the truth. Wow, it's really something. But at the same time, she suddenly had a lot of enemies. They must have been rivals, jealous of her newfound fame. After all the harassment, her family. What? I'm sorry. I'll tell the rest some other time. I don't think I've had enough to drink today. Go easy on the booze, okay? You got a meal. All right. Ooh. This is our latest in the coverage of the mysterious weakening death epidemic. Matthew Miller was found dead today. We retraced his footsteps from the day before as part of our investigation. This epidemic, a horrible mess. According to his mother, who spoke with him on the phone, after that point, he'd been plagued with nightmares. I started to think about our high school days after what happened to Paul. Oh boy, Paul loved the girls back then, too. You and Orlando were always doing stupid things. Didn't you guys once eat Catherine's lunch and get chewed out for it? Did we? I know she was mad, but she started bringing you snacks once in a while. Remember? I thought she just wasn't hungry. Eh, dumbass. There was so much going on back then. We were all busy with our own problems. It wasn't all fun, but I felt more alive. More than I do now. It's with you all of a sudden. Is something bothering you? No. <sighs> hey, really, what's, what's going on? I'm just reminiscing. I'm gonna have another drink. 
But you're going home. Careful. Sure. Time to fast. Well, of course, that was to be expected. You ready? I'm gonna talk to Dan. Hi, this morning must have been hard for you. Well, I guess I was gonna volunteer for showing up so suddenly. But I wanted to talk to you a little more, face to face. I'm not helping my boss ever again, I'll tell you that. It was bad luck for both of us. Don't worry about it, kid. <sighs> oh man, bro. This game. It's you. Sit. I've been waiting to speak alone with you. I can't believe you don't remember me. And all this time I was striving to one up you. One up? What? Change the markets with a nod of my head. I've got friends in every branch of government you can think of. I've done a complete 180 from when I was in grade school. So why do I feel so powerless? Dude, it was never. Dude. Forget about it. I can't count how many times I've had to get Erica to cover my drinks until I can pay later. You. You always had so many friends. I guess I'll never win. I can't make the one person that I love happy. Oh, Anna, was it? Out of everything in my life, she's the one thing I ever chose for myself. But I have another fiance. Uh, I don't know what to say. I don't need your pity. Well, you didn't have to say it like mail. that. You didn't have to say it like that. Uh, who, who turned? Of course. How's it going, Vincent? What are you doing right now? Drinking with friends. Uh, I'm still at work. Let me see. Why do you care? Drinking with friends. Next time, okay. Still at work. Next time. Okay. <laughs> yeah. What am I doing? Hey. hey. Are you alone today? Yeah. Do I look like a good person? No, you don't. I wonder. You've got a dirty heart, but a good eye. I'm one of the worst people ever. Huh? I sleep with lots of women, take their money, and run. Lather, rinse, repeat. Why? I don't like women. They disgust me. <sighs> what about you? Are you usually loyal to them? Oh, well, I guess. I mean, I've been dating my girlfriend for a while now. So you mean you'd pull back even if the woman of your dreams hit on you? You pull back even if the woman of your dreams hit on you. I think I failed. I don't know. Women don't stay true either. A happy family is just an illusion. Mothers and sons are just women and men when it comes down to it. Huh? Just kidding. I'm going now. I only came to have one drink. Sure, man. Oh. Shit. It's from her. Pick it up. Pick it on up. Vincent. Oh, see you, Catherine. What do you want? Y'all just be barging in the room without knocking. Huh? Bro, my chair. Well, my chair's been broken for a while anyways. I keep keep telling myself I need to buy a new chair. Hey man, he's gonna be barging in when I'm knocking, bro. 
<laughs> like, I appreciate it, Knock. At least let me know you're coming. But now I don't even know what she said. Crap. Hey, uh, yeah, yeah, she does. Didn't I tell you? No, I was just asking. It's not unusual, is it? You're right. Okay. I great. I didn't hear what they were saying. Oh my gosh. Let me get a drink real quick before I Well I, I can't drink here. Well let me go finish mine over here first. Keep letting stuff get in the way. I know this is sudden, but here's some trivia for you as you seem to have finished the class. Have you ever heard of hot butter drum? It's a cocktail that combines rum with hot water, sugar, and butter. I know what you're thinking rum and butter? But the two actually pair quite well. The drink's sweet scent is perfect on a cold day. That was the cocktail trivia for tonight. Do you already? Hey, can I get a drink? What would you like to drink? Well, I'll try sake. I'll bring it right over. The bar is closing soon. Okay. Process called heat sterilization to prevent them from spoiling. However, draft sake is not pasteurized. It goes bad quickly, so be sure to drink it in a timely fashion. Relax and enjoy your cold sake with some tofu or sashimi. And that is the sake trivia for tonight. Do you already? What would you like? No thanks. I'll pass. game any good? I tried it because Todd, my boss, was into it. It's a lot of pushing and pulling, just like relationships with women. Nothing but trouble. Okay. I'm nothing to say right there. I drink and drink, but I can't get drunk. Vincent, that woman you were with this morning... Was she your girlfriend? Sorry, that must have been a shot, but yeah. Her name's Catherine. Almost like yours. Really? What a coincidence. Yeah, you're telling me. I only saw her for a second, but she looked beautiful. Erica was just telling me that couples in a relationship hold their significant others dear to them. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they definitely should, shouldn't they? What's up? Something on your mind? It's about my piano playing. There's... there's something missing. Really? I think you're doing pretty good. I think I'm close. If I can find out what I'm missing, maybe... Hey, thanks for helping Rin earlier. That guy's just having trouble with his wife. Oh, so that's what's going on. 
He's not a bad person, really. I if he acts up again, I'll take care of it. I've been getting the feeling like people keep staring at me. Maybe I'm showing a little too much cleavage. It's just you. Hey, don't shoot me down just like that with three words. Come on. I know you sneak a peek at me every so often. No, I don't. Three words again? No. <laughs> It's all about the recent chain of deaths. Just between you and me, it seems an acquaintance of one of our customers has passed away. It's just a coincidence. Well, I don't believe in curses either. But to incur the grudge of a female is a horrifying thing. You see, my wife left. When she was away on vacation, I brought a young lady just having a little fun. And then she comes home all of a sudden. After that, she's swinging all kinds of improvised weaponry at me. Phew, what a night. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, but still, I love my wife even now. She's a classy lady. Hmm. Then maybe there's no reason for you to worry about the curse. I mean, if cheating is the cause of the curse, everything's already been taken care of, right? I see. You're right. Maybe that's why I don't have strange nightmares? Besides, it's just a rumor anyway. It's stupid. Hell, we'll just move on once they figure out what's causing this. I'm gonna head home. Excuse You've me. You got a mail. All right, man. <laughs> Stop blowing me off. I just wanted to see you. Can I at least call you? Call us over here. You wanna talk to me that bad? Don't call me. Don't be so selfish. You want to talk to me that bad? We got nothing to talk about. Not here, man. Perhaps the nightmares are being caused by a lack of sleep. But even so, how could so many people be experiencing the same thing. In times like this, having a little chat with Rin may help you to de-stress. Although, I must say there's something about the way she plays that I just can't get used to. Yeah, isn't that everybody? I'm kind of tired. I haven't been able to sleep lately. I tried staying in my girlfriend's place, but that makes me even more tired. Your girlfriend, huh? What's she like? <laughs> what? You, you wanna know? You never talk about it. Toby was wondering too. There's nothing to talk about. Maybe later. Hmm? Do you You got a mail. Tonight. Did, did I just hear something? Sorry about that. I'm back. Um, I guess I'll finish talking to you two and just head out. A lot of customers have been asking about Rin lately. Really? Why not? I guess those rumors about a mysterious piano player are getting around. Rin's pretty cute and definitely getting better at piano. Who knows? Maybe it's the start of something big. 
Then I could quit working here and become Rin's manager. <laughs> In your dreams. I think I know what the next level is. Uh, you getting tired? It's scary, isn't it? <laughs> I'll be waiting for you at the quadrant. You'll be frozen. Yes, sir! This voice. Huh? Yes, sir! The quadrangle! Which, just in case y'all didn't know, is my favorite levels in the Castling games. Love the quadrangle. You'll see why when we uh when we get there. <laughs> yeah, you showing off some. Jeez. Vincent, I don't know, man. Honestly, I would man, cheating cheating's bad. Don't don't cheat. But at the same time, hey, low key, man, Vincent, he's kind of living his life right now. Wow, you don't look so hot. You should go home and get some rest. I know. Oh, yeah, about my bill. Uh... Yeah, put it on your tab, right? I know, I know. Anyway, just make sure you get home safely, okay? With all the rumors and bad news going around. Ah, you worry too much, Erica. I'll be fine. See you soon. <laughs> Ren didn't want to walk home this time, or does Eric do that? I mean, I'm not playing either way. Just wanted to make sure. It's not from another girl, is it, Vincent? We still need to meet my parents and tell them. No one can tell you how to live your life, Vincent. Alright, next stage! We've come. Tonight we we'll visit the quadrant. I didn't expect to climb this high. Stepping on an like ice block four you stages slide until you reach the edge. It's a dangerous hazard that can lead to instant death. Be careful. <laughs> Look at this. Ha <laughs> Snow? Shit, it's cold. I I'm gonna freeze to death. Love this stage, man. Stage five is my favorite. Love the quadrant. Incorporates the ice mechanic really well. And overall, the stage just looks amazing. Just gotta be careful. Okay, I just didn't. I just didn't want to fall right there. I didn't want to fall. Cause ice, <laughs> ice is deadly, like they said. So, gotta be careful. Okay, what the heck? What dance are you doing? Dude's dancing. Y'all see that? Oh! I got scared, dude. I thought I was dead. Edge. 
sorry, man. <laughs> yeah, he's gone. Gotta be careful. I'm lazy to move, buddy. One death that was on me because apparently I said I understood the mechanics of ice, but I don't. But that one wasn't that bad. But like I said, around stage four is when it starts to get difficult. You know what? I'm not gonna lie, that was kind of bad, but I thought it was okay. But yeah, it's gonna get more difficult. Ugh! Look at that big hole. Hulk sheep. A piano player looks a little bummed out. Oh yeah. Wasn't there another guy who always supported her? I haven't seen him today. Rin, what's wrong? You don't look so good. I I saw it happen. I saw someone fall. Someone who liked my music. I felt so helpless. Are there things I just have no control over? I'm scared. Thinking about you disappearing. Don't worry, I'll make it through, no matter what. Vincent. Oh. Well, let's talk to you. If women were to run, men would live like gods. And wherever women end, foolish men are born. I won't return to that reality. <laughs> hey, what's the matter with you? Get a hold of yourself. Yeah, there's no talking to him. Yeah, there's no talking to him. That kid in the confession booth told me that my living would deny somebody else of a future. So, what's my sin? What did I do and when? I don't know. Actually, it'd be kind of creepy if I did know, would it? Oh, I don't get this. I'm going crazy. Oh, I don't get this. I'm going crazy. <sighs> but all of them only think of saving themselves. They're only friendly on the outside. They're hypocrites. Just like the people who surround me every day. I don't join them. I don't need their help to climb some blocks. Uh, I just thought of a technique. I didn't ask you to teach me anything. I was talking out loud. Allow me to explain ice evasion. This is going to be important, especially in this world. If you want to move around ice stones without slipping, hang. As long as you're hanging off the side, you won't have to worry about slipping. I won't thank you. As I said, I'm just talking to myself. <laughs> Master Bruce, if you could be with me, what would you want to retain? Hmm? <laughs> Maybe the son of a rich family. I see. Well, money can't buy happiness. I would like to be reborn as anything but a human. I want to live free from the shackles of money. I'm really looking forward to my next life. Hey, we're gonna make it out of here. It's too early to be thinking about reincarnation. Would you cry if I died? Bro, that goes without saying. Of course I would. But don't say that. We're gonna make it through this. All of us. Hmm. There are some things I need to think about. So, please go on ahead without me. Alright. I'd better see you on the next floor. Go on without me, and don't worry. <sighs> what do you want to be reborn as? You die and it's over. Simple as that. But I have more important things to worry about right now. Like how I can get away from her. She? A girl. A former fan of mine. Him? I used to be a singer in an indie band. A damn rich boy hit it big, and I was stuck in the that bitch walked away from me too. 
Now a monster that looks just like her keeps tormenting me, asking why I gave up. But what was I supposed to do? Following your dreams is a luxury of the rich. Hmm. What's that supposed I didn't to mean? Have the cash. That's all there is to it. <sighs> I don't know like you're kind of talking down on him, man. Hey. Yeah. Speak of the devil. Huh? Some of the other guys were talking about a sheep that had been climbing really well. When you devise a new technique, teach us. We'll let you know what we've come up with, too. Let's work together and get out alive. You're a great climber. Teach us some of your moves when you have time. Uh, she's the witch. She wants revenge. I broke up with her because she lied about being pregnant. And now look at me. Uh, the pregnancy was a lie? What do you mean? She just wanted to get married. To women like her, men are slaves. She just wanted an easy life. Women like her? A clerk at my company. Fuck. How does she know dad? Huh? If she's the one who cursed me here, then why does dad come out every night? What's that? The big one. Every night, my dad comes after me. It's just your father, right? I mean, why is that scary? Uh, look, I'm gonna get out of this hell. Okay. Look, I'm gonna get out of this. All right, man. Uh -huh. Today's lamb is nasty. Might be special techniques. Tell me something. Do you know of this technique? Allow me to explain ice pulling. If you're holding onto a block when you move onto an ice block, you won't go sliding off. But remember, you can't push while you're standing on an ice block. You can only pull. That's all I've got for right now, but feel free to talk to me anytime. It's really helpful. You're really thoughtful. You not only have skill, but spirit and tenacity as well. The weak cling to the strong. It raises their chances of survival, after all. Hmm. Let's both do our best. Is this place hell? She did tell me to go to hell. Who? The chick I slept with the other day. The boss was saying that his girl is a witch, though. Jeez, man, you gotta fix that. I've been working hard this far, but maybe I'm nearing the end of my road. Come on, you're not done yet. You got the strength to be pessimistic. You can keep climbing. Wow, I always thought it. But you really are amazing. You're going around encouraging everyone, raising morale. It's truly something. The scenery sure's changed. Is this the fifth floor? It's getting more and more complex, though. I don't know if I can keep this up. If you're worried, I can tell you the techniques I've learned. <laughs> Thanks. You're a kind sheep. You're famous for being a great climber. I gotta keep up now. Hey. All right. Dude, you're just, you're just weird, bro. Oh, I don't know what to tell him, man. <laughs> There's no fix to them. I'm telling you, man, he got that because he keeps taking all them sheep. Speaking of sheep, look at the picture. Look at the picture. Just who are you? Why are you doing this? <laughs> I could explain, but I doubt you'd understand. In any case, sit down if you want to talk. <laughs> <laughs> you got past the ice and made it to the fifth floor. Would it kill you to smile a bit? Now that I think about it, the piano's melody seemed a little more melancholy than usual. <laughs> it's almost time to judge your true value. My true value? I've already answered so many questions. What more do you want from me? This is the sixth question. Do you like or despise the idea of working hard? Hate it. Get that, get a hard work out of here. possibility is budding within you one that will also affect everyone else a new path could be overwhelming for someone as indecisive as you but I'll warn you the road you wish to take may not be open well apparently I'm on good pace for that so I don't know what you're talking about right there
Okay. More, uh, looks around the same, actually. I think it's a little bit more towards the women's side, I think. But then again, it honestly looks the same. I don't know. If there is a difference, you'll let me know, right? Second floor. Grab pushing an ice block or hanging onto an edge will let you move over one without sliding. Study the terrain and find a safe route. Come again. Fuck! Next. This is about done with this, man. <laughs> Get that. Bro, let me tell you something right now. You're not gonna disrespect me like that again in your life. Bro! Okay, I see where I'm going with this. Yeah, yeah, you did all that for what? You did all that for what? Nothing. You really just had a whole fight with me for no reason. Man, do I really want to go for that? I want to try. I want to hang off. There's no point. Just start it over. I don't even know why I'm trying so hard, bro. That's what you get, bro. I don't be wanting to do it, man. But sometimes they they leave me no choice, or they just do it to themselves. Right there, he did to himself. I ain't even doing that. Here we go. And I can go over here. The no repercussion. I don't think I'm gonna need that. Bro, do you want me to? I'm sorry, bro. You wouldn't move. I told you, man, they be doing it to themselves. Can you move? Bro. They be doing it to themselves. I don't be doing nothing. Like, all you have to do is move out the way. Like, they're just standing there. Do something. Like, help me help you. So you mean to tell me I couldn't do it because you were right there? Move. Great, now I lost it, bro. Bro, be quiet, narrator. I don't need to undo. If I wouldn't need to undo, I would have undo. How can I not reach that? By the power of music. I just want to know how I couldn't reach that. I'm just saying. If you can't find a way, you may wish to undo. Bro, I, 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 I'm gonna need you to shut up. Relax, man. I got this. I got this. Right? No, I do not. You know what? Alright. He got that one. He got it. Going out like that. Right, I got it. Dang, shape. Like, what are you doing? Like, bro, man, you wanna. Right, Come here. That's what I thought. Get out of my way. Bro, let me tell you something. I swear, bro. I don't be trying to. I don't be trying to be rude, man. But that's what I gotta do. 
I ain't got no problem. I don't want no hard feelings. Should have got the way. Catch them every time. I don't even try it sometimes. They just be doing it. Yeah, I already know he's just. Yep, I knew that was gonna happen. Okay, how do I get past this one? I'm doing something wrong. Had a streak right there. But come on, all right. Well, it's clear I'm not gonna get in that. Mr. Kokichi Oma. Bro. Tough, man. I'm going that way. Alright. Woo! I'm not going to sulk 
anymore. I grow stronger every day just by being with you. Me too. Being around you gives me so much more confidence. You're amazing, Vincent. Encouraging everyone, even in a place like this. Uh, they may look like sheep, but that doesn't bother me anymore. What's important is who they are on the inside. On the inside? Yep. All there is to it. You're... you're right. You really are incredible, Vincent. Wait, really? After meeting you, I feel like I can play my music the way I've always imagined. You're such an amazing person. But I did. You worked hard to get me here. Saving me when I'm in danger. Cheering me up when all hope seems lost. <laughs> That's not fair. <laughs> oh, I almost forgot. I wrote some lyrics to cheer you on. I'll sing it to show you my gratitude. Go! Go! Fight! Fight! Thanks. Aww. <laughs> some techniques. That's <laughs> his deal. I see that golden sheep in there. It worked. Everybody disappears once they get bored. Tired people fuck up. Huh? Money. It would all worked out if I had money. That was the only thing he had that I didn't. Making it big without the talent to back it up. After his big break, everyone's attitude totally changed. Even her. She turned tail straight into his arms. Was I just garbage to her after that? It's not my fault. Please tell me that's not my fault. And I'm not so sure about that, bro. Sounds like you're using money as an excuse. <laughs> What's your deal? You don't know anything. It's it's not my fault. <gasps> She's coming up next. She's going to kill me. Who is? The woman I left yesterday and the day before. She was laughing hysterically as she chased me. Seriously? And reaching the limits of my ability. Hey, do you wish for your loved one to be happy? Well, of course. Even if it makes you unhappy? I'll find a way for us both. Things are working. So... You're an idealist, then. If it's impossible to marry her, then it's best for her if we break up. What? But I love her. I have to tell her. Tomorrow. That we're breaking up. Let's just focus on getting out of here before you start thinking about what you're gonna do. If I have to hurt Annie, then... <sighs> There's nothing in life money can't buy. 
Pull it up. I'm glad you're safe. What? You've got a unique way of climbing. Like, you've used that technique here? You're a sharp thinker, and quick. Huh, really? The others are talking about you. They want to be like you. Well, let's both do our best. I'm glad. Hey, it's you. Well, you got any new techniques to give me? Let's put our heads together to survive. First, let me give you a little move that I thought of. Allow me to explain the Geronimo. Oh, taking advantage of springs? Or, nope, I'm stupid. When you fall from the stone, you can catch yourself if there is a place you can grab it. Probably gonna need you to slide this. If you see a spot that you can grab it, you can then let go without any fear. Well, was that at least slightly useful? Oh, I just had an idea. You think of this. Allow me to explain controlled demolition. When you are confronted with stones that form a level above your head like a roof, try pushing the support stones to collapse it. Consider which blocks you need to push to cause the blocks you want to fall. Then you climb onto the collapsed roof. Wow, that's great and very practical. I think I'll try using that next time. Hello. Please, try talking with that man over there. The sheep with the big hair and the cigar. We talk about our techniques whenever we meet up. But he's not joining in this time. I'm kind of worried about him. For people who live by their reactions like him, stopping to reflect on himself can be dangerous. Hey. Please? Ooh, you're awfully bold today. Just sit. <laughs> Want to know, please? I didn't think you'd be able to lead the other sheep all the way here. It appears that pianist is providing you with emotional support. Hmm? Well, that may lead to your demise. There's nothing more cruel than giving someone false hopes. What the hell are you talking about? Let me give you a friendly warning. That pianist is hiding a very big secret. Let's hope you don't get betrayed, okay? You're just trying to scare me because I've come farther than you ever expected. This is the second okay, let me question think about for this. a new possibility. Would you be able to accept any secret your lover may have? Would you be able to accept any secret your lover may have? I'd be okay. Okay, that's three. Hmm. That's your answer? I see. So about that piano. If the performance is genuine, it has the power to change a person's fate. It'd be interesting to see what happens when a little lost lamb hears it. What, what do you mean? I mean that doors of possibility are beginning to open. Not just for you, but for others as well. Others? The night will end soon, too. I wonder what kind of bricks they use to pave the road to hell. I wonder too, man. Okay, I'm starting to be a little bit... I'm starting to be a little bit too nice for my answers. I'm gonna have to be very rude. I'm gonna have to be a little bit evil here. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, that's very skewered. You can clearly see that. More... <laughs> More men are against the idea of accepting a secret, saying it depends on it. But more women say it'd be okay. Ooh. See, that's why I love it. Juicy. This is the final area for tonight. Enemy avalanche attacks can be avoided by grabbing a block. Use all the techniques you've learned to reach the pinnacle of this ice mountain. Let's do it. Don't run. <laughs> Catherine! Ooh. A wedding no Hold on, hold on. Calm down now. Here we go. Ooh. <laughs> oh boy, here we go. Oh, grab a block, grab a block. Edge. Right, I got it. Edge. Oh, yeah. Grab, 
block. Alright, we're good. We're good. Oh no, that's not good. I can't see! Woo! No! Not today! Not today! Oh, I got body. Dang, man, I kind of dang. I was looking doing so good too. But still, give me that. That that was a speed. That was a dang near speed run. I don't want to hear. It. That was a speed run. I gotta get out of here. The bride from home. That one was easy. I knew it. <laughs> no, no, this is just a nightmare. <laughs> yes, that one was very easy compared to the other one. All right, that was a dang your speed run. That's gotta be a goal. That's gotta be a goal. Because I ain't going for the goal. I'm scared, okay, man. Come in some slack. Whoa, you woke up at 5.30 this time? Hmm? <sighs> <sighs> Hello? Is this Vincent? Uh, yeah? Who is... You know Catherine, right? <sighs> Huh? Um, yeah, but... Wait, you the guy that was stalking Rin the other day? Stalking? Of course not! Oh, sorry. So, by Catherine, you mean... This is Steve. Catherine's boyfriend? What? Are you serious? Hmm? Huh? things off with her. Yeah, I was planning to do it in the first place. In the first place? <laughs> really? Yeah. I, I never thought it would end up this way. <sighs> this is for your sake as well. You know the difference between right and wrong, right? I'll kill you. Okay. Oh, what? Everyone want with me. 
Well, at least now I can resolve this situation with her. He said his name was Steve. In any case, Catherine's gotta agree to break up with me once I tell her about this. I'll see her one more time to have a talk. Pulled up. <sighs> what in the hell was that? Sorry. Did I wake you? Yes, are those your pajamas? They are. I didn't have any, so Erica gave me these. Really? That's nice of her. They look good on you. <laughs> hey. You sure you're okay? Um, well, what do you mean? You look like something's wrong. Yeah, I know. I guess lately a lot's been happening. Maybe I'm stressed. Vincent. You're okay? Erica told me this can really help make people feel better. Mm, she smells nice. I feel so... Vincent, I love you. Hmm. Hmm? Hmm? It's okay. Know that I'll always be there for you. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Just hold on. Um, just remembered I had to be somewhere. Oh, yeah, I need to go chat with a friend of mine. I almost forgot. Boy, <laughs> that would have been a disaster. <laughs> uh, Steve? I don't know anyone named Steve. What? Really? What's this about? Why are you bringing up this Steve guy out of the blue? I got a call this morning. This guy Steve said he's your boyfriend. Huh? What? He said he was my boyfriend? Yeah. He called me up. He said he was Catherine's boyfriend. Hmm. Well, obviously someone's got the entirely wrong person. Huh? But, but he... I told you it's not me. Really? Then who is it? How would I know? Maybe it's some other Catherine you know. Yeah, like I know her. Hmm? Wait. No, 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 I can't be. Um, you really know another Catherine? Just... Just let me think for a second, please. Um... Was I the one being double-crossed? Well, if she's cheating, then I can cheat too. Both of us can be happy with multiple partners. No, 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 no. What the hell am I thinking? Although, now my plan to break up with Catherine with this Steve information is ruined. If she finds out about Catherine now, I am totally fucked. I need to play this off. 
Uh, hey, wait, wait. Maybe this guy is just one of your lurkers. Huh? What do you mean? There's gotta be countless men that have fallen for you, right? Maybe one of them is still trying to get you to fall for him. I mean, you are cute. <laughs> huh? God, what am I saying? Hmm. Anyway, maybe this guy's not even named Steve. He's probably some creeper trying to act slick. <laughs> You're scaring me. Oh, sorry. You know, let's let's just drop it. Hey, you're the one that brought it up. It can't be. So, um, after we get out of here. Cheating on me. It's absurd. No, it, it, that's impossible. But can I really say it's absolutely impossible? I can't. Uh. Hey, are you listening? Oh. Sorry, I kind of, kind of zoned out there. You know, being with you is a real pain sometimes. Huh? Oh, sorry. Whatever. I'm going now. See you later. Yeah. No, wait! You can't come over tonight. Too late. I've already decided. Seriously, tonight is not a good time for me. I, uh, get really bad diarrhea. Hmm. That's so? Well, if you're not feeling well, I guess there's no point in going. Take care. Okay. <sighs> she may be the one cheating? <laughs> That's impossible. Not Catherine. Honestly, man, I wouldn't be surprised. Always meeting new people for work. Plus, she doesn't always choose hey, the best guys. Stop saying right? it like I've been cheating time? all this time. Ugh, don't you get it? It isn't about length. Jeez, you men are such pigs. Next time she's here, tell me, man. <laughs> I want to see her. Yeah, this wasn't supposed to be a meetup. <sighs> I get this at all. Why did it turn out this way? This all sounds like a huge pain. Oh, come on, stop being so down. I mean, you don't even know if she's really cheating, right? Oh. So, what are you gonna do now? What else can I do? I have to know. Seriously. I'm just in shock now. In shock, my ass. Even if it's true, you're not innocent either. You're just a selfish pig. <laughs> she's right, you know. I know... I know I'm doing the same thing. I knew she was lying to me. I couldn't take it. And yet here I am. Oh, man. Great job, Erica. Hey, Vincent. Wow. What a loser. It's your fault. You, you made him feel bad. This anymore. You're really bringing me down, man. So she dumped him? Yep. People say he's in bad shape. He's looking pretty messed up now. He might not pull out of this. He may even show up on the morning news. Don't joke about that, man. That's not cool. Anyway, did you hear what happened? Ah, oh, jeez. This place is getting pretty loud these days. Hey, it might not just be a rumor. It's like, you know, the dream where you're falling and you'll die if you hit the ground before you wake up. Lately, a lot of customers have been talking about having strange dreams. That's just stupid. How's anyone supposed to know what dream the dying person had? They're dead. It's just a dream. It's real. Right, Vincent? Maybe he's already dead. Vince! Vince, wake up or you'll die! Seriously. Is he gonna be okay? I'm not dead yet. Yeah, I'm gonna take a piss. me or did she get like way better at playing piano hey toby what's going on what's it look like we're getting this on camera didn't you see the news this morning rin's trending man 
big story about the beautiful pianist who lost her memory. They say, if you send someone a video of her, they'll get their wish granted. Oh, come on. Oh, well, I heard it lets you meet your true self. Seriously? Oh, man. Well, what I heard was that it would fix your broken-ass relationship. Bullshit. Don't sweat the details. Just think of it as a good luck piano. That's it. I'm adding you, Vince. You could use a pick-me-up. You got a mail. Hey, leave me out of this. Come on, why not? It's supposed to get stronger the more you send out. Uh, that's called spam. Do you regret it, though? Yeah, check out how good she looks on camera. Uh, I guess. You're a real pro now, Rin. Music like that could raise the dead. So, what's your secret? <laughs> it's all thanks to you. Nah, don't sell yourself short. So, Rin, about this morning... Yo, I... do it again! <laughs> I want in on this. Okay, sure. Oh, uh, could you play that one song? Oh, my, my girlfriend loves it. What's it called? Rin's getting awfully popular. It's been like this all day. People can't get enough of that piano. Yeah. <laughs> Don't tell me you're jealous. Like you're not so special. It's not like that. It's just more like watching a bird leave the nest, you know? Besides, I already got it. <sighs> yeah, yeah, jeez. Men are so self-centered. Hey, you'd better not be sending mixed messages. I'm worried. Rin's a little naive, you know? People get their hearts broken over this kind of thing. And it's pretty clear that... Pretty clear that what? Never mind. Just ignore me. I wonder what she actually was gonna say right there. What? She has a crush on me? Because if that's the case, yeah, yeah, that's pretty evident. You got a mail. I mean, we, we, we heard. We heard what she said in that one scene. <sighs> Make sure to eat the cake before it goes bad. By the way, have you heard any rumors about a pianist who lost her memory? I'm kind of curious because everyone's kind of talking about her. Uh, you mean about the pianist of uh, happiness? Brings you luck. I'll send you the video. All right. <laughs> Are you feeling better? I got bored, so I watched TV. This pianist girl looks look, look familiar. I have no idea what you're talking about. Nah. Uh, I mean, you heard her play at the bar. I don't want to say it's just a fad. I'm sure it's just a fad. Even that was good. I called it a fad. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna end it here. Oh boy. Definitely a lot of stuff to dissect here. So, in the next episode. We will tackle on the next few parts of the game. We're nearing the end, believe it or not, already. Actually, we're not. I say... We're about almost halfway done, for being honest. I feel like the halfway point is when you start stage six. And the reason I say this is because, granted, yes, the first levels are there. They're longer than others. Actually, I'm not so sure about that. I consider stage five and between that and six to be the halfway. So, you know what? No, we are at the halfway point. I'm tripping. Don't worry about but yeah, that's going to do it for this uh, stream, video, whatever you want to call it. Thank you guys for watching the 12th day of Eunice. This has been Mike Syke, a.k.a. Green Team, a.k.a. Mike, signing off. Stay cool, keep it classy. Peace.